I'm lucky that with um with um Home and Away or any other TV product um productions I've been involved with, I've been very fortunate that I kind of put it out there if it's going to be long term that I need time out to do plays. And uh, Channel 7 has always been very generous with letting me do that and ask for that. So, yeah, I just get it written into my contract. So the negotiation is more, does it suit the storyline? I think because um, Home and Away revolves around the younger cast members, it doesn't break any storylines in half if I take time out to go. So, yeah, so I'm lucky in that way. Oh, look, it, it, I'm very fortunate that they're very flexible and they let me go to do other things, which is 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 very important to me and I'm very, very grateful for it. Um, look, I mean, I adore working with Ray. I adore working with Emily and they're the, they're the cast that I usually revolve around a lot and Lynn and Ada and um, Jimmy. Um, and honestly, while Ray's there, I wouldn't leave um, because my character is his daughter and my, my storyline revolves around him. While Ray is on the show, I won't be going anywhere. Mark Kilmurray, who's the artistic director of the ensemble, decided to revisit the the piece again last year when we did a big um, sort of celebration of David's 50 years in the industry. We did a piece from it, just a scene from it, and everyone went, oh, you know, this is good. And and Mark said we should relaunch it. We should do another um, another production of it. This is a great play that was written by David Williamson um, a, a 13 years ago, actually, this year. And uh, Glenn Hazeldean and I did it originally um, 13 years ago. And we had a ball. We were, we were both sort of in our mid to, you know, he was in his early, oh no, you were 39. Oh my God. He was, he was a baby and I was in my mid forties. And, um, and when we first did the play, uh, because of our ages, it sort of resonated in a certain way. And now that we're 13 years older, the whole play resonates in a very different way because things mean different things to you when you're older and you feel like options might not, you know, might be running out and, and I just think the comedy hits in a different way. And, yeah, so it's matured into a really interesting and fun, you know, volatile, you know, two people who are completely ill-matched together, finding a way to be together kind of way. Yeah, it's a, it's a good old rom-com, really. Mark Mark Kilmurray is uh, just brilliant. You know, I've worked, I've been lucky enough to work with him quite a few times, um, actually. Uh, I think twice as a director now and twice as an actor and... Oh, three times as a director, I can't remember, but I've been working with him since uh, for about 18 years now. <laughs> um, and he's just fantastic and I adore working with him. And he's also um, he's also quite a good mate. And I um, it's just a fun, vibrant, you know, exciting, challenging room that we're when we're rehearsing.